So it's the next morning. The people have been walking all night. So now we're gonna go to the temple where they finish their pilgrimage. The night before, the mood at Maha Marymount Temple was somber, serious, and sacred. During the daytime, as devotees completed their walk to Kalumali Murungan Temple, the mood was jovial, jubilant, and joyous. Devotees and their processions enter the temple grounds and do a complete lap around. When they are finished, they find themselves at the front of the temple. It is here that they perform the Kavadi Atan, or burden dance. There is a line of people with jugs on their heads, waiting to make their offerings inside the temple to the gods. The spirit of the festival can find its way into anyone. It is not uncommon to see people suddenly be overcome by faith or go into a trance seemingly out of nowhere. But the sense of community felt by all makes sure that they are taken care of. By the end, participants are exhausted, physically and mentally, but are satiated in a way my camera won't be able to show you. Remember, this is a month-long process of eating a certain diet, sleeping on the floor, praying regularly, and more that ends with a physically taxing journey with a literal representation of the burdens they are seeking God to help them with. Yeah. Oh, I'm not